Sitting across from me, Master of the High Court, Edmund Honan. You reckon that in the Department of Finance there isn't enough knowledge about law and in the Department of Justice there isn't enough knowledge about finance? I suppose you might call me a virtual judge. I'm Master of the High Court and I do have a particularly exclusive position. The Constitution, that's what I wanted to bring the debate back to. I said, this, we need to take out the article in the Constitution and look at it again and say, actually, it's not a categoric as, as, as one might think. They take an oath of office to judge without fear or favour. We had a, a wave, a torrent of, of, of possession cases. They're called repossession cases, but they're actually they're possession cases. I suppose if you owe the money... Actually, they're not. And I said, well, why are they doing this? We don't know, they say. And I don't know either. I don't know why the banks are pursuing people by means of a judgment mortgage. It seems to me to be a bit of an industry. And I said, what part? And they said, well, we don't know. And I said, well, if you don't know, then it's void for uncertainty. It wasn't his fault, you know, that the economy collapsed. And what about if somebody can't afford um, legal representation? That's what we're dealing with now most of the time. The, the, the procedures of court are possibly in breach of the Human Rights Convention. But automatically you feel it's completely stacked against you. And it is. We're simply creating new ghettos in nice houses. There's another point which I want to make. It's quite important because, again, I was listening to the radio. I listen to the radio a lot. And Very good somebody, idea. somebody, one of these new PIP people was saying, briefly he said, well, of course, bankruptcy. He said, oh, you, you, wouldn't want to, you wouldn't want to go there. That's not, that's not. But in fact, bankruptcy is the one thing you have to be prepared to tell the bank you're prepared to do. You need to go into the bank with your application for bankruptcy, which is a petition to the High Court, filled out and plonk it on the desk in front of them and say, there, it'll only cost me 60 euro to apply for bankruptcy. Now the bank will sit up. The only money that's there is the money that's being paid to the banks on a month-by-month -month basis by every mortgage holder. This should be diverted. Mortgage holders should be allowed to hand the bank an IOU saying, I'll see you at the end of the term, I'll pay this at the end of the term. Promissory note. A promissory note. Just like the national one. An economic stimulus by promissory note. Exactly, yes. And we'd lift off. And actually, it would be better for the banks and the government because I've looked at the figures. We will leave it there for the moment. Edmund uh, Honan, thank you very much indeed for coming in.